Hey guys, welcome back to another Sea of Thieves guide. Today I'm going to be showing you an extremely efficient method of gathering supplies that is seriously unknown for how effective it is, and you'll see from the video that this can help you in both PvE and PvP situations. If you do enjoy the video, please feel free to like, subscribe, or give me some feedback in the comments. Now let's get into it. So as most of us are aware, you can find barrels or flotsams in the water whilst you're sailing around. These barrels in general are a very good way of stocking up as they are filled with a lot of good quality supplies. They tend to be filled with generic supplies such as food, cannonballs, planks, throwballs, whatever. But what most people don't know is the type or quantity of supplies that you receive from these barrels can change depending on where you are or what you are doing. The particular type of barrels I'm going to be highlighting are what I call fleet barrels. These are barrels which are primarily for fighting PvE ships, so are typically filled with either 15 to 30 cannonballs or planks per barrel, which can total up to a crazy amount altogether. From this set here I managed to get 72 cannonballs and 61 planks. These are insane numbers of supplies given how easy it is to obtain them from the barrels by simply harpooning them to your ship and taking the supplies from them. Now as the name suggests, you'll typically find these near or within fleets of sorts. These will include Order of Souls fleet quests, skeleton ships either out in the open water or a part of skeleton fleet world events, and even the Lords of the Sea tall tale. This is pretty much just anywhere where you can fight PvE ships. Now some of you might be thinking that you'd have to be doing these quests or world events yourself in order to get these supplies, but you'll find that you can just simply be near any of these encounters. As you can see from this clip, I'm not even within range of the ghost ships to shoot me, yet I am stocking up from the fleet barrels. So if you're ever sailing by one of these encounters and see some barrels, you can quickly stop by for a few seconds and stock up on some good supplies. Finally, if you can pair this method with a storage crate, it is obscene how quickly you can obtain a large number of supplies from fleet barrels. That'll be all for today's video guys. If you want to see more videos on how to stock up, let me know. And if you enjoyed the video, please feel free to like and subscribe to the channel. Good luck and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.